Today, I want to take this basic modified metahuman and add a metallic element to the face. Following on from my tutorials about painting metahumans in Substance Painter and Quixel Mixer, we will continue today by adding a metallic element. I select my metahuman and locate the face mesh and I will go to the folder where that asset is stored. Here it is. And I'm going to export this in the normal way as an FBX. Here are the options I'm exporting with. And now I need to export the textures. So I'm not going to be doing animated textures today, so I'm going to select our base color, normal and roughness and export those. We need to modify the mesh and I'm going to do this in Blender. All I'm going to do is remove the armature and then go into edit mode and remove the eyes and the mouth, etc. Because all I want in the end is an empty head shell. I will then export this for painting. Today for painting, I will be using Substance Painter. You can use Quixel Mixer if you like. And this is the options for the import. And once imported, I now need to import my textures that I exported from Unreal Engine. Start with our base color, normal and roughness. Here they are. And then I'm going to drag each of these onto the model and do a fill on each one of the textures. Here's the normal. And then finally, I'm going to add the roughness in the same way, but I am going to only filter the red channel on this roughness texture. I've already covered this in the previous tutorials, which are linked in the description. Okay, so let me position my metallic element on the metahuman's face. There we go. And now I'm going to export this. Again, I'm going to go through this quite quickly, as I already covered it in my previous tutorial. We set up base color, normal. Here I'm going to place an emissive, which I'm not going to use. Next is our roughness. And I'm going to make sure the roughness is in the red channel only. Our metallic texture, which will be a grayscale texture. Finally, set up the opacity in the base color, and that's it. I'm now going to create a preset from this which I can reuse, uh, set up target as the export and then export. And that's it. Let's now import back into the engine. I'm going to create a new folder to store the images and just simply drag them into the engine. The first thing I need to do is modify my roughness map and I'm going to come down to composite texture mode and make sure our normal is added to the green channel. Like so. Next, I'm going to open up the material for our metahuman head. Here it is. 
and I'm going to search for animated and I'm going to disable animated albedo and normals for the purposes of the tutorial. Next, I'm going to scroll down to our color main and select our new texture. There it is. And then scroll down to our normal, normal main and select our normal. Then scroll down to our roughness main and select our new roughness map. And there we go. Okay, next we're going to need to add the metallic element. So I'm going to find the base material for our metahuman head. Here it is, head baked. And here I'm going to create a texture 2D parameter with a lerp. It may be better to add a add node here rather than a lerp experiment. And we're going to name this metallic texture. I'm going to connect this to the lerp. And then I need to choose our metallic texture. Here it is. And then I'm going to connect the lerp to metallic. There we go. Now all I need to do is just simply adjust the roughness to get the desired result. There you go. And that's it. If you want to support the channel, you can go to the thanks button underneath this video and help that way. Alternatively, you can go to buymeacoffee.com and support me that way. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please remember to like and subscribe. I will see you in the next one.